Hi guys! Today we'll be reviewing RRG wig in brunette colour. This brunette wig is modelled by one of our favourite custom dolls, Tiffany Madison, who is MAG28 with hazel eyes. I am not sure how to describe this exact colour of this brunette wig. If you look very closely, it consists of several shades of lighter and darker browns, and the sunlight brings out some ginger in it. However, under normal lighting, it looks quite flat, single tone, medium brown. As for comparison with other AG dolls, it's darker than Marisol's but lighter than Samantha's, Chris's, or MAG55. It is definitely much darker than Kanani though. The brunette wig is very soft but it still feels like it's not as soft as our Be Forever Samantha who has by far the softest wig of all AG dolls we have. It is very easy to brush. Just use wire brush and water or diluted braid spray on the ends to detangle. However, we have noticed it loses some hair during the brushing even if we're being very careful. It is not just restricted to this colour. It may be because it's very wavy and once it straightens itself a bit, the issue will settle down. As for the length, it's the same average 33cm as all other wavy wigs we own, with some strands being longer than others. However, we feel that when we compare it to other five shades of RRG wigs we got, the brunette one looks the shortest. This particular wig seems most wavy of all the wigs we recently purchased, so maybe that's why it is the shortest. Personally, I would have preferred if the wig was the darker colour like MAG55. I feel that the thickness of the RRG wig is much better than MAG55's who we found was quite thin. You could recurl the wig or straighten it or even cut it shorter if you prefer to modify the wig to customise it further. However, we tend to leave it as it came originally. As you can see, the wig has short hair when parted, which helps to hide the wig cap a little bit if the hair is split into braids or ponytails. Here's Marie Grace modelling two French braids. As with all wavy parting wigs from RRG, you can choose to part it sideways or have no parting like McKenna or Kylie which is useful for different hairstyles. Apparently you could set the parting with the heat of a hairdryer, so it would always stay in the position. If you do decide to try this method yourself, please remember that the hair is made out of plastic and so is the plastic skin tag top. So please take great care not to burn and melt the plastic with the heat of the hairdryer. The wig cap is light in colour, it's very stretchy and it fits our American Girl dolls very well. The only complaint we have is that this particular wig stitching around the plastic partition skin tag is not as good as the other wigs from RRG. However, under normal hair play it won't show as much. As with all RRG wigs, the plastic skin tag is light in colour and it shows if the hair is parted, but it's not always noticeable. It really depends on how you part it. In conclusion, I think this brunette wig will suit all skin tones and eye colours. In my opinion, the colour is not as beautiful as brunettes from AG, but if you're after a natural medium brown replacement wig with a decent length, I would recommend this one. I hope you found this useful. Thank you for watching. Bye.